Welcome, everybody, to TechPix Demo Day. So uh, this is the first day when the companies that have been growing here at TechPix really present to investors uh, and to the general public. Um, I guess everybody is pretty nervous, so you will excuse some little movements or mistakes. But uh, we're welcoming not only you, because we're on live streaming, we're welcoming also the people who are following us on the web, on uh, uh, techpix.eu. And uh, for all of you, our Twitter channel uh, is present in every page of your booklet, and it's ashtpdemo13. Okay? And let's start. So what is TechPix? TechPix is a startup accelerator. But it's not just another startup accelerator. It's uh, the first public international people accelerator. And uh, by um, public, we mean this is a public initiative and international, we mean that we opened a call for people to come from all over the world to stay with us here in Trento. It's a residential program, so we were providing accommodation, uh, monthly allowance, and office space to the people who joined us. And so we put together a set of world-class mentors that come from all over the world, mostly from Europe and the United States, and that were, mo for the most part, digital entrepreneurs that met startups one-to-one. Uh, -one. And the goal all of, of all of this was to bootstrap uh, the local entrepreneurial ecosystem by opening up the doors to international entrepreneurs. Um, so we did that by attracting uh, talents in the ICT sector. Why ICT? Uh, well, uh, we think that information communication technologies are the enabler for a number of other sectors to develop faster and more efficiently. And so that's how we boost the general ecosystem. Um, we built a worldwide network. We're building a worldwide network of ICT entrepreneurs. The alumni of uh, TechPix1 will stay in touch with us and among themselves and uh, help us grow uh, the number of connections worldwide. Uh, by doing this, we want to create opportunities for the tech pickers, for the participants, but also for the local ecosystem. Mm, and we connect everybody uh, from the entrepreneurial side also with the research and the university that are top ranking in, in Italy in the last uh, few years. Um, so I said we're a startup accelerator, but we're also people accelerator. And what does that mean? Normally, private accelerators open the call to teams with ideas. Uh, TechPix opens the call also to individuals with ideas, or to teams or individuals that don't have an idea. And we help them come here and work on their idea on site and find their team on site or other team members. Um, so we, uh, the whole the idea is that team formation happens here as well, or at least team reinforcement or team collapse, if that is the case. Um, that is the reason why the business ideas that you will see presenting today range from uh, on a very large uh, range of maturity. From very, very beginning, because they were born here, um, they, they, maybe they were born here four months ago, three months ago, or pivoted even a couple of weeks ago, to uh, companies that came here already as a team with a business idea and they developed uh, their business even farther here with us. So expect to see this large range of ideas on stage today. Um, and then it's uh, also um, the time to, um, to, uh, to say uh, thank you to the organizations that uh, brought this to, to you and to the community, uh, Trento Rise, Trentino Sviluppo, 
and the autonomous province of Trent, of course. And so it's my pleasure now to call on stage Antonietta Tomasulo from the Board of Directors of Trentino Sviluppo and Fausto Giunchiglia from President Trent Rice uh, for a salutation. Please, Antonietta and Fausto. Thanks, this one everybody. Is. So it's really a pleasure to be here. We started this a bunch of months ago, and uh, we were dreaming and hoping for a success. We still hope so, and it's not a, it's a motivated hope. And uh, from our point of view, as a trend to rise, uh, we really are looking forward to this, and we're also looking forward towards further support of the existing startups and the future startups. Um, this is just for me an opportunity to say that uh, in the next budget of next year, together with Paolo and others, we will uh, uh, think of initiatives, concrete initiatives, which uh, we hopefully will help you and the future startups to um, make it easier to be successful in your uh, entrepreneurship uh, activity. This for all, and thanks for you to be here, and uh, that's a fun. Thank you. Thank you, uh, thank you very much. Yes, um, I've, I've been told to be very, very sharp, so I'm gonna be very, very sharp. And uh, Trentino Sviluppo has been very proud to be part of this uh, important uh, experiment uh, and pivotal uh, project in which uh, I agree with uh, Dr. Giunchiglia, we hope uh, to really contribute more and to do more uh, in the next, uh, very next future. And uh, my only comment is, uh, um, if we have to measure success, uh, uh, your success uh, for the entrepreneurial ideas and the project you are doing, but if I have to measure that, I think you guys are gonna be very successful because I've been watching you behind the scene from my point of view. And I saw you very driven, very passionate, really fighting through all of these months, through all the system. Again, this has been a kind of an experiment for all of us. But you've been through, you've been uh, working hard. I saw you working high and behind. And so this itself is a success. And, so, and then the business is business. But again, uh, the important point is that you try. You really try for yourself. Uh, and then uh, something good is always happening. And this is an experiment that is going to teach us, uh, the system here, how to improve and how to do better. And of course, uh, we hope also as Trentino Sviluppo as the system to do something more, something better for uh, this kind of uh, project and process. Thank you very much. Thank you, Antonietta. Yes, thank you, Fausto. Thank you, Antonietta. And now, uh, also, we have uh, a salutation on the video uh, from the former president of the province, Mr. Lorenzo Dellai, who wanted to be with us today, but because of other um, uh, meetings, he couldn't come. So he uh, recorded a video uh, to say hello uh, to everybody. He was the president who firmly wanted this program. Uh, and uh, uh, he is now in the parliament in Rome. Uh, and well, here he is. Please, the video. Il Trentino di solito è conosciuto per le sue bellezze naturali, per le sue montagne, per i suoi laghi, qualche volta per la sua storia. Forse meno conosciuto è il Trentino per ciò che in questi decenni eh, abbiamo saputo fare sul piano della conoscenza, della ricerca e dell'innovazione. Un'università di grandissima qualità, centri di ricerca conosciuti e stimati a livello internazionale, 800 ricercatori presenti solo nel campo dell'ICT e una rete di realtà ormai collegate a livello internazionale che si occupano della filiera della conoscenza. Ora è in questo quadro che è maturato il progetto che viene presentato oggi, un progetto che unisce tutto questo con la necessità di produrre valore, di creare nuovo valore a partire dai talenti dei giovani trentini, italiani e di tutto il mondo. È in questo quadro che il Trentino chiede a tutti gli investitori, a chi si occupa di far crescere tutto questo valore, di avere fiducia, di investire e di entrare in questa storia meravigliosa che il Trentino ha saputo costruire con tanti anni di sacrificio. 
Okay. Thank you, Mr. Delay. And uh, so, let's go on. Let me tell you a bit more information about what happened. So, uh, we had, uh, we opened the call uh, for applications on January the 18th this year. We closed it on April the 5th, uh, and we had received over 600 uh, individual applications and from 54 different countries all over the world. Um, we went through a selection process and we published the results already uh, after 17 days on April the 22nd. Um, and uh, we had selected 72 people. We had nine last minute drop offs ranging from a company that split three days before joining uh, to uh, one uh, person who had problems with her partner and so didn't come here for love reasons. Uh, but uh, in the end, uh, 63 people arrived from uh, 19 different countries and uh, 61 survived. Uh, the average age for the curious is 29 years old, but the range starts from the early 20s to the late 30s. Um, and uh, one person was 40 uh, as well. Okay, uh, so uh, when I say they come from all over the world, I really mean it. Um, so th we didn't limit the call only to Europe or only to Italy, but this was a totally international call. We managed to reach out uh, to people who applied from uh, basically all the continents. Um, and uh, the selection, in the selection we got people coming from Eastern Europe, Italy of course, Eastern Europe, France, UK, uh, Russia, Ukraine, Belarus, uh, but also the United States, uh, Nepal, uh, Jamaica, uh, and uh, so on, and Portugal, I think, but I said most of them. Um, and of these, 35% are Italians, uh, about 30% are Europeans out of Italy, and 35% are out of the EU. Um, so, next slide. Uh, people Accelerator is about the people. So, uh, I would like to take this occasion to have a round of applause and a big thank you for all the tech speakers. Um, you see here some of the faces. We couldn't fit them all in the slide. Um, so, uh, they, they actually showed a lot of commitment, uh, even notwithstanding the various difficulties that we had throughout this, uh, these six months. It was the first time I think we uh, achieved great results, but that was mostly because the startups worked very hard. Um, and uh, so, to all the startups today, uh, I wish you personally good luck from me and all the TechPicks team. Uh, to the investors, um, I wish uh, that you open your eyes uh, for investments here and you find occasions uh, because there are some very good propositions. And to all the others who are here, just uh, enjoy the event. And uh, we're ready now to start with the pitches a bit in advance. And that will give us more time for the lunch break uh, where investors can meet on the one-to-one, -one, the, the startups downstairs, and for the others, we'll see then um, each other for more pitches at 2 p.m. Okay, so let's, let's grow a bit the energy here. Let's uh, shout a big yo and call for the first round of startups. Yo! Let's go! Hi all, my name is Mark, uh, and my co-founder Philip and I love to travel. As a matter of fact, we're always on the road and our business travels with us. But every time we relocate, our professional network becomes irrelevant. Uh, we have nobody to ask help to or ask questions to. Um, so, for instance, imagine you were in Hong Kong. How would you find a talented designer? Or how would you find out about the best co-working space in town? To, also, to answer all these questions, we've, been, we've built City Pulse, a location-driven professional network. City Pulse helps you find other professionals near your current location, 
helps you find places to work, events to attend, or other businesses relevant to your activity. We are focusing on the tech industry, and we'll be targeting all the major tech hubs. This week, we are launching City Pulse Berlin. We've built a mobile app, a web app, and have gathered thousands of data points about Berlin's tech scene. So that City Pulse is relevant from day one, but becomes even more powerful as the community grows and contributes. Finally, our technology allows us to expand to other cities in less than a week. So think City Pulse Milan, City Pulse London, or City Pulse San Francisco. We're Mark and Philip, and we want to help traveling professionals be more productive. Please come talk to us if you'd like to find out more. Thank you. Hi, my name is Marita and I'm a CEO of Skybury. I am also a pilot and the biggest paradox for me is that everyone complains that flights are expensive when there are thousands of extremely low fares available every day. There are just three problems. They are hard to find, expire quickly, and no algorithm can spot them. But we have found a solution. We provide up to 90% cheaper flights. For example, Peru from Italy for 120 euros. And this is round trip after all taxes, by the way. So how is this possible? We have a community of experts that include freelance flight hackers and travel agents. They find the best first and send them to us. And then you tell us where and when you want to go. And once we have a fare that matches your preferences, we will send you a push notification via our mobile app, Facebook, or email. And you can book it instantly. The best deals usually expire in one day, so being quick is the key. And more flexibility means better price. So far, we have over 100 experts, and out of 94 deals published on our blog, we made over 70 sales. Ah, and on every ticket, we make 10 euros. So if you need a flight back from Trento, just come and talk to us. Thanks. Hi, I'm Damiano, and I'm here with uh, Vladimir, Mariano, and Helen. And we are building MapNote, which is the fastest and simplest way to save and share place marks on a mobile app. So why, why is it like that? Well, you see all three points are the same. The first one is how you save the place mark. It, I just did it before coming on stage. I, I simply write a description uh, of what I'm doing here. The second one is how I categorize that place mark by using hashtags and mentions. And the third one is how I shared it on Twitter. But of course, I didn't have to do that three times. I just wrote one caption. And it's a lot more than a simple tweet, because I also bookmarked a physical, precise location. So there are, of course, other apps that allow you to do the same, like Google Maps and Foursquare. They also give you suggestions, reviews, ratings, navigation, all this kind of stuff. But when it comes to place marking, they make it awfully difficult. It's like using a Swiss army knife for your daily meal. What we give you is a simple fork and a knife, which is the simplest solution, and it really gets to the point. Because if I was to check in here with Foursquare, for example, I would get something like, I'm at Teatro Cuminetti, which is right, we are here, but that's not very, really relevant to us, because we know this place because it's the place of the TechPix demo day, and I know it because I'm pr presenting MapNote here. So this is relevant. It's a very simple thing, but it's a complete revolution. Thank you. Welcome. Hello, mom. My name is Tibor, co-founder of Snapclip, the startup who simplifies video editing. We have a vision that people shouldn't have to spend hours and even days on video editing. It should be as simple as using PowerPoint. We invested three months into creating a cloud-based video editing platform so that you can forget about the difficulties of the process. Imagine you are making a video about your child on the beach who's playing, and you can record it, upload it to our service, and edit it, and 
What about importing a video from YouTube? You can edit it, and then with a simple click, you can push it back to YouTube. As simple as that. We know that our service meets a huge demand because every month, more than four million people are looking for video editing software in Google. And we are going to give them an answer. We made a lot of progress. So today, we would like to meet with an investor who is experienced in media, and we would like to team up and revolutionize video editing so we can make a lot of money. So please visit us in the demo room because we have a working prototype to show you. Thank you, we are Snapclip and we are simplifying video editing. Let me, let me give you some more information about what happened in these six months. We started, th this is a six month program. We started with a number of activities ranging from uh, climbing the mountains that are the backbone of this territory for team building to business uh, uh, workshops and to one-to-one -one mentorship programs. Um, and uh, we actually started, this is the mountains, but we have also the other photos. Can we go on? Yep, business uh, workshops and mentorship. Go on, yeah, next slide. Uh, so we uh, started everything on May the 30th, but we had the opening ceremony with, um, where we, we were honored to host uh, the Prime Minister, uh, Mr. Enri Enrico Letta, and uh, the President of the province at, this, at that time, uh, Mr. Alberto Packer. Um, and then um, after that, we went through two months of pitching where uh, the participants could pitch to uh, gain uh, the possibility of accessing uh, 25,000 euros grant. Uh, 18 teams were selected. Uh, they started spending the money in October. Uh, and so in that sense, that is also, the access to the funds has been pretty recent, and that, is, that reinforces the idea that here things are still very young and we come even before private accelerators. Um, then the next phase will include a uh, 1 million euro commitment for matching funds. So the, the companies that uh, find a private investor can candidate to come and get a matching fund of one euro per one euro of investing money from the private investor. So the exact rules will come very soon. Well, uh, they will come after a deliberation of uh, the province, and so we will publish the details when the de deliberation is available. And with this, I'll leave you to the next three startups. Some time ago, you were a little kid. Remember how much fun it was to play with your toys? And now, kids spending their time staring on the iPad screen with no interaction with the physical words. And plot picks, we're not asking kids to give up their iPads. But with the computer vision, we are combining two words into an even better, richer experience. In our ABC Blocks game, child can say basic word like cat or tea. When mobile camera view pointed to a word, our mobile application instantly transformed into a picture and teach child how to say the word. Magic. It's a much better experience, either the blocks or a path alone. At LearnPix, we move very fast. In two weeks, we completed the first game. In a four months, we converted that product into the complete product lines. We have secured a manufacturer and signed the contract to sell our product in more than 250 stores. LearnPix will be sold in Aushan, Silpo, Ica Market Chain. Please come to our table to see how fun to play with our toys. You don't even need to be a kid. 
Thank you very much, Maxim Ronchin, Leon Peaks. If you do it right, it will last forever. This is a quote by Massimo Vignelli. He's a designer, I'm a designer, and I love him. And uh, want to buy this poster for 10 euros. Some designer. Oh, cool. <laughs> Thanks, man. All right. So, <laughs> so um, Kuta. Uh, Kuta is uh, the first community-based platform for quotes. It allows users to read, discover, and share quotes of historical and contemporary people. Now, you can log in, set your preferences, choose the authors you like and topics you like, and it focuses on good typography, readability, and, uh, um, well, yeah, it has a um, uh, gorgeous color palette, really. There are 50 million people searching for quotes every month, and do you know why? Because they find answers, and they need motivations, authority, and brilliancy. So this platform totally reinvents the way people enjoy these messages online. And if you want uh, a free poster, talk to me later. Thank you. Hello, everybody. My name is Mike, and I'm co-founder of Your Crowd. So Your Crowd is a mobile app that solves the problem of privately collecting pictures from a community of people. Let me give you an example. La Sportiva is a well-known brand of mountain equipment gear, and they're using Your Crowd to push real-time photo contests during events they're sponsoring. With our tool, they're able to collect and review all the user-generated content in one place, and they can publish it uh, anywhere they like with no licensing issue. At La Sportiva, they were once used to do this process with a complicated web form for submitting pictures, and today they're using our tool. We have a white label prototype ready to be tested by our uh, alpha customers with some relevant name in the Italian uh, tourism and leisure industry. And uh, our team has an extensive experience uh, in business design and development. But today we're here to looking for uh, the right investors that uh, can help us to boost up our go-to-market strategy. So, well, that's uh, your crowd. If you want to know more, uh, or if you want uh, a slice of this wonderful homemade cake, you can come later to our stand. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hello. So, uh, as you understand, we are giving a piece of information after the other to let you concentrate more on the pitches. Uh, when it comes. So um, this is the time where I'd like to thank uh, all the network of, a uh, global network of private accelerators that supported us. Um, it was really uh, important for us to uh, feel that we were already in connection with one of the possible uh, outcomes and next stage for most of the startups joining um, in excellent accelerators around Europe and the world. Uh, so uh, we partnered with uh, um, these uh, initiatives in order to make a value chain, started from early, early stage to the next, not so less early stage, and then going towards venture capital. So um, our partners for this round were uh, in order, in alphabetic order, um, 11 uh, in um, Bulgaria. Cheer. <laughs> Geek Accelerator in Romania, cheers. Uh, Founder Institute all over the world. <laughs> H Farm in Italy. I Catapult in uh, Hungary, Mandelbridge in Italy, and California, and Seed Camp in the UK and all over Europe. So thank again, thanks to these partners. And uh, also many thanks to the European Institute of Technology, ICT Labs who is uh, actually, it's the network where Trentrise uh, uh, is uh, a part and TechPix is also part of 
uh, the activities of the EITI City Labs in Europe. And we are connected with nodes in Berlin, Paris, uh, Eindhoven, Stockholm, Helsinki, and uh, very soon also in London. Um, so, um, next slides. Uh, then we, uh, I'd also like to thank now partners that, have joined, that are still joining us in these months. Uh, and there are financial partners and technical partners from Italy and also from all over the world. You will recognize big names uh, going from Amazon Web Services, Google, uh, SoftLayer, IBM, and uh, Microsoft Bitsford. So uh, these are also supporting us and they're joining and we, we hope we can grow this network even further. Uh, and thanks to these as well. And then finally, last but not least, um, next slide please. Uh, I'd like to, to thank all the local partners who made this possible. Uh, of course, Trentorize, new business creation team, but all the structure and Trentino Sviluppo Innovation uh, were, were collaborating very closely for making this happen, but other uh, institutions in the territory helped us very much, and the province of Trento, not only with the funding, but also with international relations uh, and the visas was very, very helpful. Uh, the API uh, that is uh, helping us on all the line uh, to get the funding, and uh, Unicredit who uh, supported uh, the credit lines that enabled expenses to start uh, very uh, soon. And of course, the University of Trento and FBK who are supporting with technology, researchers, and students uh, for the internships uh, to the startups. So uh, with this uh, round, uh, it's finished, and I'll leave you to the next round of startups. Thank you. Buongiorno. I am Bimal. I'm from Nepal, and I'm CEO of Snipper. Snipper is a platform to follow and read everything about the people who are most important to you. Those people could be professors, journalists, favorite authors, and bloggers. When Snipper collects all the articles from the web, it automatically creates profiles, which makes it simpler for you to follow your favorite people. Then you can read, share, and save the articles for the future. You can categorize the people who you follow into different buckets, and we call them read list, read list make it simple for you to get updated from all the articles. Also, you can share those list, read lists with your friends. I have something like 10 economic professors from Ivy League. Whenever any of those 10 professors write, I get automatic update, which is amazing. So far, we have created 500 profiles of top business schools, uh, professors. Our goal is to get the people read and follow these professors and ultimately follow, get these professors on their profile so that Snipper becomes the ultimate platform to connect knowledge creators with their readers. We love reading, and if you love reading, let us meet Lara. Thank you. Hello. My name is Matej, I'm the CEO and the co-founder of openprova.com. Do you know what is the best way for students to get prepared for math exams? It's by solving lots of math problems. But students very often get stuck on a step and they don't really can't figure out how to continue without extra help. The problem is they have no resources out there except very expensive private tutors. Openprova.com has a solution. We uh, our community of teachers creates uh, a huge set of uh, practice problems along with the detailed step-by-step -step solutions. The way OpenProf works is we crowdsource. We have a fast-growing and very active community of teachers creating high-quality content. At the moment, we offer our content for free. This will change next year when we start selling our step-by-step -step solutions and 50% of the income will go to the teachers who created the content. Our positioning is unique as we target concerned parents who want to help their kids to succeed in school. 
in Slovenia, our first market, 30% of high school students are using OpenProf. Then we moved to Italy, where within just three months, we managed to engage 700 teachers. We are currently looking for investment to expand further into the Italian market and then to enter English-speaking markets. If you're interested, please come and talk to us. Thank you very much. OpenPro.com. Hello. Our business experience divided into parts. What we know and what we can do. When someone hires us, he pays attention to what we know, but then he pays us for what we can do. When facing problems and tasks at work, we are all around solving our problems. Diplomas and cert certificates can't help. Only experience can teach us professional skills. We focused on this problem and created an educational system for learning business skills from established professionals who already solved similar tasks and have rich expertise. Uh, managers join our courses to work with professionals on a particular task and professionals motivated to enrich their business experience through various business cases. It's a new educational method which based on a uh, combination of simple web services, Trello, Skype, and Google Docs. It's an elegant way to earn extra money for professionals while being employed. And no one did before such a simple way. Thank you very much for your attention. <laughs> Me and my partner, we are together already seven years and we run already two successful businesses. Now we're seeking mentors and funding to convert our method into technology. Thank you very much. Okay, here I am for the last time on stage uh, today, and now I would like to explain to you what we did uh, for the territory already uh, during the program. Uh, so uh, we said that we're doing this to boost the local ecosystem, so we uh, connected uh, the, the entrepreneurs to uh, the, the local ecosystem in terms of people in research, uh, entrepreneurs, uh, but also um, education um, and courses for schools and other associations in the civil society. Uh, this is what we call the Trentino Ecosystem Accelerator Program. It's a part of TechPix, um, and uh, it's been pretty, pretty interesting uh, what happened. Next slide. So we delivered we delivered uh, 19 projects for a total of 1,800 hours uh, that the tech pickers dedicated to the, to the territory. And about 500 of these hours were uh, done with research labs and professors and researchers. Um, so that is uh, just the beginning. Uh, it's, uh, it's the first experiment. And next time, we will do even more. So uh, we had, next slide, we had for this um, a very, very large number of local partners. And uh, it's very long to name them all, but you have the logos here and at the end of your booklet, so you can see, but we range really on all, in all those kind of uh, categories that I uh, mentioned before. Um, so uh, we, uh, again, uh, this was done uh, mostly uh, by, well, it was done 100% by the participants in the program on top of their work uh, for their startups. Uh, and that's because TechPix doesn't take equity from the shares of the company, but it asks for time equity to grow even further the local ecosystem. And we uh, also seek to increase the number of partners that we had this time. Uh, so if anybody wants to join us for the next time, please uh, connect to us. We will be happy to uh, include uh, new projects and add new partners for this. Uh, so um, 
let me give now the stage to the last round of startups before lunch. Thank you. Hi, I'm Alexander, and I have a quick question for you. How many of you are wearing clothes? I guess all of you, so no naked people this time, which is good. And speaking of clothes, there is uh, this problem that people find it hard to dress well. Why? Because you have to know how to combine colors, patterns, materials. And these people, they tell us, we would like to dress well, but we don't know how to start. So, my best friend and I are building Lucastic, which uh, helps people to dress better. And here is how it works. Uh, you tell us what items you own. Like, in my case, I would say I have brown shoes, red pants, and white, white shirt. It analyzes my wardrobe and gives me recommendations, show, shows me inspirational pictures on how I can combine these items. This is cool, but where is the money? And the money is here. Not only we can combine your clothes that you already own, we can give you recommendations on what you can buy. So in my case, it can give me a recommendation like, for your wardrobe, blue jeans will make a perfect match. And here is where you can buy these blue jeans. So e-commerce is happy, buyers are happy, and we are happy. Uh, if you are in the fashion industry or in the e-commerce industry, come talk to me. We are Locastic and we are changing the way people dress. Thank you. Hello, my name is Leo, and I'm CTO and co-founder of Pricelessly. The charity market is a huge industry of $30 billion of donations made online each year. Probably you have seen one of these websites that asking you to donate several dollars to the charity, but something stops you to do that. Pricelessly is not like these websites. We partner with famous people to allow you to have chance to meet them by donating small amount of money to charity. For example, if you ever wanted to meet Andriy Shevchenko, the f famous football player, you just need to donate to his charity that supports education of kids in Ukraine. You will receive unique prize and chance to meet Andriy Shevchenko personally. We take a percentage of all donations that are made on our website. We have our product ready. We have signed up celebrities. We will start to receive revenue right away. In 2014, we are looking for a way to expand our operations both in terms of markets and celebrities. We are working in European and East European regions. That is why we are different from our major competitors. I am Leo, we are Pricelessly, and I will be very glad to meet you at our stand. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, my name is Adam. Friends tell me stories about the lost parties where they saw the girl that they really liked, but they finally didn't approach. Also, girls keep telling me that there's something wrong with the guys because it looks like they were afraid of them. But guys are not afraid of girls. Just the first step is something really hard to make because the biggest human fear is rejection. So we came up with Entice that tells you who likes you at the next party. Before going to the event, you select the people you like, and if you also get selected by them, and only in this case, you both get notified. We are promoting in bars and clubs and going to run campaigns in universities because our strategy is to bring entice to smaller communities, then go to other cities and countries. We have a successful online version where every third visitor signs up, and now we are working on a mobile app. We are the new wave of online dating services which has a huge market. We are looking for international advisors and business people from this industry, so if you're interested, don't be afraid to approach me. Thanks. Okay, so with that, we are extremely early and we're very happy of that because this is gonna give
give to investors more time to meet the startups. There are eight more startups that will pitch from 2 p.m. on. So be on time here because we start at 2 p.m. exactly. And, uh, and now the tech peers and investors are invited for uh, one to one um, like uh, exclusive event downstairs. And for all the others, again, see you at 2 p.m. Thank you very much. When I wake up, well, I know I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be the man who wakes up next to you. When I go out, yeah, I know I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be the man who goes along with you. If I get drunk, well, I know I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be the man who gets drunk next to you. And if I heaver, yeah, I know I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be the man who's heavering to you. But...